Hello, I am Professor Sundar Raj. In my earlier videos, I had demonstrated a plus b whole cube and a minus b whole cube using 27 identical cubes. Now, today I will demonstrate a cube minus b cube identity using again 27 identical cubes like this. Could be of any dimension. Now, we will start with 27 cubes arranged as a big cube. We will assume that the length of this is a. That is, the edge of the cube is a, height is a, width is a. So, the volume of this whole cube is a cube. Now, let us assume that this small one, that is one cube here, the volume is b cube, taking b as each, time, each uh, edge, the volume will be b cube. Now, we have from the cube, which is volume a cube, we take away b cube. So, we have a cube minus b cube. Now, this is a solid, something like say truncated cuboid. We will find the volume of this solid very easily like this. Now, this is a cuboid. Dimensions a minus b. This is a. Height is also a. So, the volume of this cuboid is a minus b into a into a. It is a minus b into a square. Now, we will take another cuboid. Say that one. Now, this cuboid has length a minus b, width is b, height is b. So, it will be volume will be a minus b into b into b, that is a minus b into b square. Now, the remaining cubes can be arranged like this. Now, here we have this is a, that is a. Width is a minus b, height is b. So we have a, a minus b, and b, the volume must be a minus b into ab. So we have altogether, this is a minus b into a square, this is a minus b into ab, this is a minus b into b square. So putting these together, we have a minus b times a square plus ab plus b squared, which is the required identity. Thanks for watching.